So, I gotten quite a bit better at using this meter and it's a bit confusing. But first off, I had a problem with that display being on. Now it's held. And apparently you just hold OK down for a few seconds. And it should turn off. It doesn't seem to be uh, always exactly clear how long to hold it and whatnot but you stay at it it looks like it will finally work so now another thing was it took a while for the display to show up before so when we hit a uh, second division here you can see we got the number of seconds there that's in full seconds we can go down or go up more seconds so basically it's taken longer for it to scroll across there so that should be the number of seconds per square right there and you turn counterclockwise to make it longer so 50 seconds now so this goes really slow if you're gonna measure something really slow now clockwise it's going faster so in the last video that I did we were not getting what was happening in this case we're measuring a flashing LED we are where the resistor and the LED connect and then the LED goes to ground so these are the voltages in real time that we are getting at that point as it changes its current current needs and uh, so really the resistor is going to let through a certain amount of current based on the voltage across it and so as the light dependent resistor needs more current there will be more voltage across the resistor and that is what we we're seeing here so in any case so we got the seconds there we press this again now we go up to this spot here and I don't know if I can widen that or not yet I would like to but uh, in any case you have to uh, turn this a lot I'm gonna zoom back and so if I go to the right it's gonna go to the left if I go clockwise it is going to the left and it's very very slow so I will uh, I will zoom in and uh, that was a little too far we will lose our focus but uh, let's try to get that back right there so now I'm going clockwise and it's very very slowly getting farther from there and what this is showing is where along the path of recorded information there we are so it's going to take a little while to scroll before it gets right here and then when it gets over there it's going to keep going right there so we can click OK and hold it and then we can scroll so now I'm going uh, counterclockwise and now I'm going clockwise so we can do that and you can see how slow so that's how much information it's recording basically and so it, it starts off in the middle and you hold down or a click click uh, select division there until that turns blue and then that's blue for seconds in fact you know what maybe if uh, we go to 20 seconds or 50 seconds that is not doing any that didn't change anything maybe let's go uh, 10 seconds yeah that didn't do what I was hoping but in any case we can just keep turning it counterclockwise until it is all the way to the right which I like better so it's in the middle that's all you gotta do click this until it shows up there so now let's go all right it's back to uh, working let's go get that off at 10 seconds that is a bit annoying so one second that's good so we'll go to the uh, voltage divisions and so now we have the voltage there let's press it again and you can see down here we got there we can move this up or down right there to uh, whatever we want and this point I think is the one volt point so let's uh, let's zoom back a little what I'm gonna do is yank the uh, jumper out and now we got zero volts so they're down there and I think that's noise that's just noise background noise wise jumping up and down 
because we got zero volts we're not measuring anything anymore so it doesn't go down to uh, zero volts it stays up I don't know like two and a half to almost five volts or something right there so so uh, yeah fiddling around with this a while it took it took a bit and the manual is not extremely clear what to do but uh, for the most part you basically just press these quick or three seconds and I don't want to do anything right now it says default you press uh, that button and that button I think it is uh, simultaneously for three seconds and after I do that it kinda acts goofy for a bit but I keep doing that finally it's something I like so in any case uh, if you got one of these trying to figure out what to do hopefully that helped and now that I'm getting better with it I actually like this a lot more it was kinda confusing at first so uh, thanks for watching I will see you in the next video